Hello everybody, this is Abraham with No Short Computer Services. What we got here is an old, really old, iOmega external hard drive and uh, it doesn't work. So the first thing we need to do is take it apart. However, there are no screws anywhere and uh, took me a little bit to realize how it works. In other words, how the uh, case is put together. We're gonna need a knife like this. By the way, this product is called iOmega Mac Companion. It uh, doesn't say anywhere on... Uh, I see. It's right here. The model is MCDHD. Mac Companion. I don't know, DHD is like external hard drive. It's a neat setup for its time. As you can see, it's got the FireWire 800, got the USB 2 probably, um, outputs, which is nice, input, and there is another USB output. This was done in uh, spirit of the time when Apple was adding USB connections to the keyboard and so on. So we need a knife like this and we're gonna jam it uh, closer to here. There, that cracks the case open. It is a bit counterintuitive that you would have to take it apart from the top. You always look for the screws at the bottom, but they decided to go again in the spirit of Mac things to be confusing. Um, very solid aluminum. You know, this, this looks really scary that you can't take it apart. And no matter how much you try to pry it from the bottom, I mean, it can probably do it, but most likely you'll break something. All right, let's keep going. This one is have to come out somehow. Probably gonna need to use a knife again. Okay, this USB connector is holding it in place. got a couple of screws. Let me see. We got a screwdriver. Let's take this out. Take this out. And, oh, two more. These seem to be going into the hard drive itself. So this unit was working for a long time and then just decided not to. Let's see what size it is. It is a two terabyte. Hard drive. Okay. Well, something else is holding it in place. Let's see. Oh, okay. There's a screw right here. I said this comes from a time when things were complicated and intimidating. All right, that is a pile of stuff that came from an external hard drive compared to what happens today. Oh man, this has definitely a lot of parts. 
All right, so we extracted the hard drive from iOmega Mac Companion made in 2011, so 10 years ago. Give me a like if you like it, if it helped to you, uh, if it helped you save money, subscribe, enjoy, and save money.